In this video, we're going to discuss what to do if you're not getting population on your 2020 SeedSense monitor. The first thing you want to verify is that you're getting speed in the upper right hand corner from the GPS system. If the GPS system is not getting speed to the 2020 seed sense, then refer to one of our videos on checking connections or the setup of your GPS monitor to output GPS to the 2020. Next, you're going to want to check the diagnose page. So you're going to navigate to the setup button and then the diagnose tab. Once here, we want to verify uh, that the diagnose page is green. You can see here I have some of my components that are not green. And so I would want to investigate what is going wrong within those components. The other button here that's going to be important is seed data. If you click on the seed data tab, here we can see the number of seeds that have been counted by each of the seed tube sensors on each row. If you're not getting seed count in that seed data column, then you're going to want to investigate, are you actually dropping the seed? If not, then you want to see what might be wrong with whatever system is controlling seeding, either the V-Drive system, the RowFlow system, or if some other third party is controlling seeding. If you are getting seed drop in the ground, you are planting, but there's no seed count here, then you're going to want to investigate the seed tube sensors and how they're connected to make sure all of that is working properly. If you're still having trouble or have other questions, refer to our manuals online at cloud.precisionplanning.com, contact your local Premier dealer, or contact us here at Product Support. Thank you.